Well, I was recently in an accident with an illegal alien. Uh, that's a Mexican who uh, is not a legal resident of the state of Alabama. Okay. Yeah, he didn't have any insurance. And I have a 78 Mustang who is uh, in critical condition tonight because of that. Mm. And there's no recourse against this individual that I know of. Would you please tell me what I should do? Okay, thank you. Well, Terry, that's a, um, it, it, that's a bad situation. And in Alabama, you do have uninsured motorist coverage, but that generally applies to personal injury claims. So if you were hurt um, and uh, you have uninsured motorist coverage, then those type of injuries can be covered by the UM coverage, provided you didn't uh, disclaim that. But for the property damage, uh, you're going to have to uh, just do your best to go after the uh, after the uninsured driver, unfortunately. Yeah, I mean, so uh, so many people run into this situation, and it's not just uh, undocumented uh, people, uh, undocumented aliens. Uh, there's such a large percentage of just regular Alabama folk, uh, working folk, that don't carry insurance, don't carry the minimum limits for whatever reason, uh, or they uh, they waive that UIM coverage, which we say is so important. It's such an in, uh, so, so inexpensive uh, that everybody out there, if you do have insurance, make sure that you have UIM coverage, uninsured or underinsured motorist coverage. Uh, you actually have to sign away your right to that coverage. So uh, if you have done that in the past, make sure that you re-up it. You call your insurance agent tomorrow and make sure because that protects you, it protects your family in the event something like this happens uh, where you may, uh, fortunately it doesn't sound like anybody was injured in this case, but a lot of times there are injuries and you're going to have medical bills, you're going to have possibly loss of wages. So if you don't have that UM, UIM, up to the level, match the levels of your liability insurance. If you have $50,000 in liability coverage, you need to have $50,000 in UM coverage. Or if it's 100000 then you need to have 100000 And unfortunately, uh, for the caller's situation, unless he has collision coverage, he's going to be out of luck. And that's pretty affordable, right, to add on to your plan or to make sure you have it as part of your plan? Oh, it's the cheapest insurance. I think it's the cheapest insurance you can buy. Uh, UI, UM, UIM insurance, I think. It's minimal. It's, it's really it's minimal, minimal cost. Okay. All right.